What's up guys and welcome back to LEGO Worlds and today we're going to be continuing on with our adventure of becoming a master builder and hopefully we can actually do it this time. One thing is that some people were saying that I didn't befriend this person but I already have her, the forest maiden. Unless there was another person I forgot to befriend? I don't know though, I don't think that's the case. Either way, our goal today will be becoming a master builder. That was last episode's goal as well, but unfortunately we didn't get many gold bricks. I'll be talking about that soon, but first off my goal is to just go to other worlds we've been to before where I know I have uh, had to skip out on some of the gold bricks either because I didn't know how to do them or I didn't have the materials to do them. We'll just be trying to revisit those worlds and see if maybe I can do something with them now and just wanna go for it. And then I'll also go and choose whatever character I wanna play for today, but one step at a time, I guess. Okay, so 30 minutes later, I'm finally here, but I'm not on an old world, I'm on a new world. So I tried loading into like a bunch of older worlds and every time the loading screen would freeze. So I'm guessing that maybe I have to hang out on a new world first. I already have you, so I don't have to worry about you. But we'll just go around here. Since it took me 30 minutes to go here and I don't wanna wait through another loading screen just in case it might freeze again, I figure I'll hang out here and do I have you? Yes, I do. Okay, I'm just trying to make sure, be extra diligent. But yeah, so I was looking at some comments and of course responding to some as well. And a lot of you guys said that you also experienced a situation where once you hit a certain amount of gold bricks, just things like chests and, th well, I have the gold brick that was over there that I was heading to. It just disappeared on me. Why does that keep happening? But, um, yeah, things like chests and things like uh, troublemakers, even if they're holding a gold brick, no longer give you a gold brick. And it looks like that's just sort of something that happens when you reach a certain level. So the only way we're gonna be able to get gold bricks is through quests, from what I see. This is a cool formation. I don't know why nothing's, you know, really here. I'm, I'm super confused about the fact that there was a gold brick here and then it disappeared. Like, why? <laughs> But there definitely are some quests that have gold bricks that I have not completed in older worlds. It's just a matter of I can't get to them right now because the game won't let me load those worlds. So for right now, I'm just trying to search around and find the closest quest, which I figured might be over here in this area. Have I found you? You look like a normal lady, like a townsfolk. You're a professor that I cannot quite find here, but you're also over here. So let me see if you have a quest, which would be pretty cool. Oh, you do? Do I have these things? Hey, you want something cool? I don't have, oh, I don't have the yellow one. All right, I'll keep that in mind, and we'll just keep looking. So there's like two people right here that require a quest. This one isn't too bad. We've done this one several times before. Yeah, we'll give it a shot. Also, you might notice that I'm really low on studs. That is just because of the fact that um I had to buy the unicorn for the thumbnail of the previous episode to get a good picture of it. Um, That looks great. Nah, nah, I'm fine. And that was just studs, not too surprised. And then you wanted something over here, lady. Where are you? Oh, hey, oh, what's up? Uh, brr, I'm freezing, an igloo would help keep me nice and warm. Do we have an igloo? I don't know, I have to find out. But yeah, the, the unicorn's like 250,000 studs, so I had to earn up a bunch of studs and buy them, or use them to buy the unicorn, so that's why I don't currently have it. Actually, I think it's in here. Do we have an igloo? Doesn't look good. We have tons of legendary coordinates, but no igloo. But I'm gonna try my absolute best to get, you know, enough gold bricks to become a master builder today. I mean, I'm still super annoyed that there was a gold brick and then it disappeared. And we'll try to take a few chests while we can, but I'm not going to, you know, spend the most of the episode getting um, chests. Like, there's one over here. This one's pretty easy to do because it's on the surface and I don't have to dig. It should be around here somewhere. Normally it is at the least. There's a troublemaker, not too interested, like, and that's something, you know, a lot of you have been saying. So, if the troublemaker's holding a gold brick, like, we'll, we'll try to break the ice. Oh, there it is, the igloo. Okay, so we'll give that back to that lady in a second. Like, I'm gonna go ahead and try to get him if I can. And if he gives me the gold brick he's holding, when then I'll keep trying to. Some that wasn't what I was trying to do. Will be oh, nearby. that little squirrel, do I have you? I yeah, I already have you, so that was a waste. Gosh darn it. I wasn't even trying to do that to him. I was trying to get this. And now, narrator won't shut up. So if this gives me the gold brick, awesome. I'll go ahead and keep getting these troublemakers. If not, yeah, I'm still at 95. So what I'm gonna do is I'm only going to get troublemakers if they have something besides a gold brick that I might need. Either that be a brick piece or something different. Hello, I have your igloo now. So let's go over here. And igloo, where are you? You are here. Oh, there we go. And I hope you like that lady, because you'll be getting one igloo once it's finished building. And finished, nice. 
So what are you gonna give me? Oh, an ice cream cone. At least we got an object for it that wasn't just studs, because typically it gives you studs anyway. So it's always like a sort of a ripoff when they give you studs, because it's just like, you were gonna get studs anyways. <laughs> well, I'm gonna keep running around and try to find some quests. Also, we have, I guess, a town over this way? Um, yeah, it says there's, there's one town. It's dark blue, which I'm pretty sure is the town. And sometimes you'll find more things around the towns, at least from what I've experienced. So why don't we try to head towards the town and if we run into um, any quests that might give us a gold break in the meantime, we'll go and check those out as well. Not a quest, oh no, it broke. <laughs> but a chest, you know, quest and chest do rhyme. So I could just say that I pronounced it wrong, you know, it meant to say chest, but that'd be dumb. We get the punk hairdo, which, well, I don't mind getting that kind of stuff. Like, that's nice to have, whoa. Are you a normal troll or are you like a special kind of troll? Yeah, you're a normal kind of troll. You look a little different, but what is going on over here? What is with this pirate flag? I have not seen this before. Mr. Pirate, what are you doing around here? Yeah, it's just a pirate flag chilling out. I have never ever seen this, this is cool. Hello, this flag ain't good enough for the captain. It needs to be a black, not red. Okay then, I can do that. I can fix that up. Um, so we gotta go down here, and here's the black color. So let's bring this up, and then paint this up as much as I can. <laughs> Covering it up. Don't think that makes it much better, but, oh, now that's a, a perfect flag, matey. I'm done. So there's studs, is that all you needed? Oh, that's all you needed, that stinks. I was hoping for a little bit more, but you know what, if that's it, that's it. Do I actually have her before we go? I don't know if I have her unlocked. And if so, oh yeah, that's right, I need to change my character for the day, so maybe I'll change into her, if she's still around. Um, no, I already have her. All right then, so we'll be a pirate lady today. That sounds like fun. Pirate lady, where are you? You're over here, do, do, do. Nice, okay, I don't know why I wanna be a pirate lady, but you know what? Sometimes in life you gotta mix things up, and how I'm mixing things up is becoming a pirate lady. Still don't, still can't get the gorilla though. It stinks because there's like so many chests in this area, and I wonder if she'll give me one. Like it feels like even the balloon lady stops giving you, uh, Golden bricks at a point. I don't have enough if she even does, which will be frustrating. I mean, maybe I could uh, spawn in some of those crystals, because if I spawn in some crystals, I can actually sell those to her, and then, you know, return my profits that way. But she is not selling any anyway, so we'll buy a, a few pies, maybe, uh, a few snowballs. It's like things I might need, like a blowpipe. Oh, I've, I've never seen the blowpipe before. There's, there's another instrument for us. I've been running around on the monkey, and the monkey moves so gosh darn fast. I love it but she doesn't have too much for me, so I'm gonna keep moving towards this way, and oh gosh, is this where the monkey will not be useful? Can he climb up this? Look at him go, he can! The monkey is awesome, and we have finally found the town. Let's reenact King Kong. <laughs> what, what, what happened? Oh, okay, it's still loading in. For a second, I got sort of freaked out. I was like, oh no, is there just like a giant like, you know, like mountain spawned into the building? Luckily, that's not the case, but let's go in here. I think this is one of the banks. And the banks usually have some chests. Now the chests probably won't be giving us gold bricks, like I said, but they might give us some other useful things, like um. Also, this is not the uh, this is the uh, lighthouse kind of thing, like a clock tower. But uh, sometimes they'll give me a, give us legendary coordinates, which is just as good. Oh, it gives me a lighthouse tower. Well, that's a weird coincidence. It's like the game is listening. And if game and game, if you are listening, give me a gold brick, please. I've been working very hard. I really want gold bricks. Why are there so many people chilling out on the sidewalk over here? Like, so many people. Oh, there's a constable. Oh, that's really cool. I've never seen the constable here. Oh, I can discover you. There's so many, like, townspeople. Helen Stone. Why is she a real life person when everybody else is just named townsperson? I don't know. <laughs> this whole situation is so weird. I'm just gonna get out of here because there's no quest around. I thought that maybe we'd find a few quests, but there's really not too many around at all. Oh, wait, gold brick. Where's our gold brick? Who needs help? Oh, is this person about to be attacked? No, 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 they're, they're flexing. Why is this caveman flexing? Yo, caveman, what's up? No, ah, oh, bear! Bear, bear, bear! Oh gosh, run, 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 clear gem agent pistol. No, wait, I want the agent pistol. Go into first person, this is an old school strategy. Oh gosh, I'm dying, I'm dying really quickly. Why do I get stuck on everything? Don't tell me that the, why is the, oh, I, I really, not a pretty, what the heck, why do you, why, did, okay, I don't like pirate ladies anymore. I am so mad right now. The first gold brick we've actually run into in like, 
like a full episode, like an hour worth of LEGO World's content. And I'm getting caught on things. I'm trying to shoot when she's trying to punch, and then she just stops moving when she pulls out the camera. Ugh, come on. What am I supposed to do? Like, the bear didn't even show up until I got there and was in, like, he attacked me before I could even do anything. Like, he was not there. I didn't see him at all. Oh, man, that is so frustrating. Seems as though there's another quest here, and I'm still, I'm not gonna get over that for a while. Where's the quest at? Um, maybe it's still loading in? Because these, these right here are chest markers. Right here, there's obviously a quest marker. I haven't seen no quest game. And obviously, like, if it was above my head, we wouldn't even see the quest marker, because it, the quest marker never marks anything below the quest. So I think there's just so, supposed to be somebody here that isn't. So maybe they're around the area and they just walked off. Okay, you don't have, all right, I guess I'll chase you. Or not, because if you're in the water, you're a pain in the chase. Yeah, I don't know who needs my help here. What is with the game being so gosh darn difficult when I have literally five gold bricks to go? There have been times where we've gotten 10 gold bricks in an episode. We did that routinely. <gasps> there it is. Who needs help? Who needs to go? Who, you, okay, you just, you just spawned in. Hello, sir. Me follow, me fellow pirate was hiding some of our booty in this cave. Wait, so, what do I gotta do? I, I accidentally pressed X when I wasn't ready to. You want me to, what, is she down there? What is with the camera? What is happening? Um, is she down here now? She is down here now. So maybe if I just bring her up, that'll make pirate man happy. All right, does that make you happy, Pirate Man? Uh, maybe if I, oh, there we go, there we go. Oh my gosh, complain enough and the game will be like, okay, dude, here, just take this and shut up. I love it, thank you. Awesome, so there we go, there we actually have 96 gold bricks. That's a sight for sore eyes, especially since my eyes are becoming so sore from how much lag there is going on right now, it's a little crazy. Oh my gosh. Oh wait, there's another one. Wait, what, what is this one now? Hold on, hold up. Who needs my help now? Are you under attack? You don't look like you're under attack. Whoa, okay, hold on. Whoa, where are you going? Where are you going, lady? Where are you going? Who even are you? I'm not even sure we're about to find out. It's so hot here, I need some water to serve. Oh, you're a surfing lady. Do I have you? Well, if we don't, we're gonna have her soon. Here, where's the water? I think the water is at the bottom. It might be at the top. It might be at the top here. Go all the way back up, and there's water around somewhere. I don't know if it actually tells you. Here's river water. Does that count? No? Not good enough? Well, um, okay, it was, it was enough, she just had the, that's not a gold brick. Oh, dang, <laughs> I was gonna say, this lady's a ripoff. <laughs> Oh gosh, awesome. We got two gold bricks. That That's, I don't know, that's just amazing. Also, I need to make sure I have her. Where's she going? She's going this way. I can't even collect her right now because of how much this has to load up. 96 gold bricks, don't die on me, lady. Are you kidding me? Gorilla, I'm disappointed in you. <laughs> well, I have no clue if we have her or not, but we're not finding out now. Now, what about these people? I had the scientist. No, if I, if I have you, I'm just gonna, oh, oh, I have you, I don't have you, so I can get you. Cave man, man of cave, cave of man. Sometimes it feels like maybe I should spend more time around the places where there are quests and just wait for them to spawn in. Like maybe I'm just not being patient enough in that regard. Apparently there, there's a quest over here, I think. Hmm, I think that one, yeah, straight ahead is one that's close by. Whoa, what was that that fell? Uh, I think it was just like a truck, yep, just a truck. This area, like, terrain generation is being a little weird, but I don't care how weird it is as long as we can get ourselves 100 gold bricks, you know? Like, it could be upside down land for all I care. I have to do some monkey climbing on the roof. I I'll do it, I'll do it for some gold bricks. I'll do just about anything, I'm desperate. All right, so these are all, um, I think these, it's really hard to tell if these are orange or green, to be honest with you. Um, They might be, green though, so I'm just gonna keep walking this way and hope that I'm going the right direction. Oh gosh, it's so confusing for my eyeballs. Um, Where's the shark at? The shark's down there. I don't think there's gonna be a gold brick dude or he'd be holding a gold brick. 
but I might as well beat this guy because the sharks, oddly enough, out of all the quests that are like this, the shark is the weakest, taking one shot from the bazooka to be blown up. Just like that. Oh, no, this was the guy I was saving. <laughs> all right, what are you gonna give me, sir? Nothing but studs. I guess that's, I, that's understandable since he didn't say he was gonna give me anything. He wasn't even really asking for help, so I won't complain about that one. But yeah, I can't tell. These must not be, oh, it's so hard to tell. I really couldn't tell you if those are orange or green. So what does this person need? This person looks like they're about to be attacked. Oh no, they just need a building. Okay, so they're a crook. I think I have this crook already though. I've heard you like to build things, try this. Okay, I'm going to cheat it out like I always do because I just wanna be a master builder and this is what master builders do is they just put thousands of bricks in the same spot, which should be impossible, but we are masters, aren't we? There we go. Good enough lady, I got you a very dense red bilk. Bread brick, not bilk. I just mix brick with milk. I don't know how. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking anymore. It's just like I've gone so insane from desperately wanting Master Builder that I can't make proper sentences anymore. Ooh, there's another gold brick. Come on, come on. I'm liking the luck streak we're having right now. I hope it continues. Oh, I don't know what's going on in this dude's room, but it looks fun. Rainbows and motorcycles. Sounds like a good combo. Those pesky paintball players are always ruining things I build. Help me cover this mess up with some fresh ice. Oh, are you making a hockey rink? Oh, that's a cool idea, I like it. I mean, the rainbow room is really cool, but the hockey rink is also a good idea. So we'll go ahead and try to help you out with this as much as we can. You really need us to fill it though for this. There you go. Good enough, right? Looking good, buddy. That's more fine. That's more than fine for me. If you are finished, yes, I am. Thank you for the gold brick. That makes 97 of them. Oh, it's beautiful. Brings a tear to my zebra eye. I am so happy right now. We are actually making progress with it. We need to, what, where, where is this 98? Is this 98 gold bricks? Oh boy, 98 gold bricks. How, somehow I miscounted, but I don't care. We have 98 gold bricks. Hello lady, you don't need a gold brick, but it seems like the more quests I do, the more of them give me golden bricks. So I'm not going to skip the ones that don't. I've heard you like to build things, try this. Now this lady's probably not gonna give me anything, but you know, sometimes there's pleasant surprises in life and maybe this is one of them. Ooh, man, she really wants a lot of them. <laughs> I really want a lot of condensed red bricks. <laughs> Looking good, buddy, that's more than fine. Okay, yeah, same as I think, but this one just studs. I don't appreciate it, but I'm glad that's one more quest we don't have to worry about. Ooh, this one looks cool. We're finding a lot of cool quests today at the least, like even if they don't give us too much. What do you want? I think I might have seen some kind of treasure in that tower, but there's no way I can reach it without some steps. I can do that for you. Look at this one, this one's actually a pretty cool one. So I wonder if I could keep it simple and like would this be enough for him? I mean, it'd be a little bit treacherous, but it would be possible. And then I can make like a bit of a staircase here. And, and is that enough for the guy? No, oh, so it looks like he, not only does he want a bridge, but he wants like a certain amount of bricks to be in it. So now I'm just gonna go ahead and do this if it's gonna count. Let's see, ooh, yeah, okay. I wonder if we just didn't create a bridge. Hey, I reckon that can go now, what do you think? Sure, give it a shot. Or just stand here forever. <laughs> I don't know why I did that, but it was really funny. <laughs> no treasure for you, it's mine. Ha 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 ha. Oh, what are you doing, sir? Come on, give me that. Give me it, you know what, okay, into the lava with you, into the lava with me, sounds even. Gold brick? <gasps> Gold brick? A hundred thousand, I'm almost there. Ooh, do I have anything I can sell? Anything not too expensive? What can give me 8,000 studs on the quickness? On the quickness, is that a word? I made it up. Oh, there we go, one blue crystal. The crystal's on the two right but now we have over 100,000 now. I can buy myself a gold brick. 99 golden bricks. This could be happening right now. We could be getting Master Builder, and that is beautiful. It counts up for so long, but it's almost there. I am so excited. Come on, where, where else can we find something? Like, look at all the purple dots. I think that's more purple dots than I've ever seen on a LEGO World's map before. Okay, so we've had this quest before. I know, I know, I, I have it, dude. You don't have to tell me. So I gave him the red potion, which is like really expensive. So hopefully he gives me something good for that. Let's see. 
He gave me a castle kit, which is okay. I think that we've needed that for a quest before. Hell, adventure, this poor man has fallen to this minotaur feeding, but can you save him? Well, him and his car, you mean? Um, first off, let's go ahead and remove that. And then there's a, is that a bone? That is a bone, so I'm not really too worried about that. We have plenty of bones. Let's, uh, <laughs> I've got a bone to pick with you. But, uh, there you go. Nope, sir, how'd you fall down there? Uh, there we go. There you go. Hey, okay. Two. I think I, I think I made it a little too high now. Uh, no, I'm pressing all the wrong buttons. You can tell I haven't played too much Lego Worlds as of late. I've been busy with other Lego games like Lego City Undercover. Okay. What are you gonna give me now? Ooh, a magic bean. Which these sell for a good price, if not anything else. So that's pretty good. Anything else for me? Ooh, there is. These lands need, wait. These lands need my aid. I require an outpost to watch over these lands. The thing he just gave us. Look at that. Okay, so he needs, where would that be then? Um, Here, castle kit. I don't know if he needs it anywhere specific, so I'm just gonna build it right here. And that was enough for him. What is he gonna give me? Where'd he go? Um, He's stuck. Let me help him out really quick. All right, I had to destroy your tower. Whoa, that is a cool looking sword that you're not gonna give me. Uh, I could give you my golden blade to defeat the Minotaur, but I'll need a gem to sharpen it first. Okay, okay, there you go. So I'm getting a cool golden sword. You know, if not anything else, look at this. Oh boy. All right then. So I got a, a few things, but that's that still wasn't enough. And there's no Minotaur by, down there, by the way. That's like the third Minotaur pit we found without a Minotaur. Are they supposed to have Minotaurs? Or maybe it's on his head? Maybe this isn't a golden sword and it's actually just like made out of like a baguette. It's a baguette sword. It's so cool though. I love it. It's really awesome. And is there another quest right here? Or is that farther away than it looks? I think it's farther away than it looks. So we're gonna go to this one over here. So we've ran into this quest a few times too. And I know that it won't, you know, we won't be able to get to the end of it. We don't have meat. And we do have meat. Okay, so as long as we have steak, we can do this one. So this one, of course, we've done, like I said, two times already, which there is a Yeti in there. So it's actually pretty simple. This, usually they have us, um, what's it called? Build out, there we go. The roof first, but I guess not this time. All right, there you go. You're gonna give me a banana. Cool, I guess. <laughs> There's your banana. Good, good, good. And now, oh, you both want something. So he wants, um, I can't really tell right now, to be honest with you. Um, traditionally, this temple roof um, would have been a striking color to make it stand out. Okay, now you want me to color things. So, I'll go ahead, nope, wrong thing. Nope, wrong thing. Go back. <laughs> um, and it doesn't look like he wants a specific color. Okay, yeah, he does not want a specific color, so I'm just gonna paint it whatever works. And hopefully one of these two guys will give me a gold brick. Your painting skills are most impressive. Nice, he gave me a fish. Okay, I've never seen that fish before. That was an orange fish. Like, you know, like the, the cheesy snacks? The temple here is missing a roof. Oh, okay, so yeah, he's just doing it in a different order this time, weird. Okay, so I might have to like, oh, wrong thing. Nope, that's not what I wanted. Why do I keep messing this up? Uh, what is going to be a good one for building a roof? Probably something like a six by 12, oh, a six by 14. I'm glad we have these really big bricks now. I'm just gonna go ahead and build a roof and hopefully this will be enough for him. Just like to cover the top of it, just like that. And then just to start building on it like crazy. Cause you can see there's two white bricks there, which I think means he also wants it to be actually covered. So let's see if this does it for him. Ooh, he wants a lot of bricks though. He is very demanding on his brick count. There we go. Jeez, he is very picky. Um. Your awesome building, yeah, okay. There we go, and he gave me a pencil, which I already have one of those, but you know, more the merrier. And that's it from him. So now I can talk to you. Me have not even er, eaten a long time. There we go, now we can do this one. So there's your steak, and then here's your apple. Ooh, at the least we can get ourselves the Yeti, which is really, really awesome. And you're gonna give me a brick build, okay. And what is this brick build? It is a communications tower? That's a weird request. <gasps> Ooh! But wait, he disappeared. Where'd he go? Yeti? Oh, Yeti, I can hear you gurgling. Where'd the Yeti go? Wait, is he in there? Yeah, I think he's in his little cage. Yeti? Yes, he is. I was gonna freak out like, game Y. All right, we've discovered you. How much, oh, 2000, you're cheap? 
You are really cheap, but even like, we don't even need to discover you for this one. All we need to do is doing no, as no, I, I, this narrator, he is a blabbermouth. I gotta tell you. Might need a Here. trip to a Talk to you. you can Let's still bring them back, hold though. circle. The quest giver turn around. Hey yo. <laughs> There's a close up of you, and then boom. Wait, what picture is it? Or what button is it? Square. And there we go. Some green berries, but more importantly, our 100th golden brick. It has finally happened after 14 episodes. Oh my gosh. Current rank, expert builder no more. Let's watch this fill up all the way. It's gonna take a second at this point. It really likes to take its time. Look at that trophy rank, master builder. It's finally happened. Oh my gosh. And the little goat's taking a nap. How adorable. Master builder. Oh, wow, look at us go. Whoa. You've done it. You are a master builder. The ultimate power of the universe is in your hands. Now, you can create your very own worlds. Jump in your ship, open the galaxy map, and press the create world button. Make it icy, make it hilly, make it yours. That is so awesome. So we can now make our own worlds. Instead of trying to find worlds, we can go ahead and make our own, which is just so amazing. Oh my gosh, we finally did it. Oh, and do we have you? Hold on, hold on, I was gonna start walking back, but yes, I finally have the, oh, this is a good day. We got the Yeti finally, we got you finally discovered. Awesome, now I'm gonna ride the eagle all the way to the uh, the ship now. No! Oh, come on, don't tell me that just happened. Oh boy. So it actually saved. No, no, no panicking everybody. Luckily it's saved, but I have to make my way all the way back and it might crash again, so let's hope that doesn't happen. All right, we're finally back at our ship. Let's do this. One. Ooh, I like how she's doing a little, oh gosh, it's too hot dance. It makes it seem like she's just really, really excited. Like, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, I can't wait. I can't wait, 99. And then finally our 100th golden brick. Yeah, <laughs> that's a weird noise for the pirate lady to make, but look at the break dance. The Pugsy is awesome. But finally, we got ourselves the master builder, 100 gold bricks, and we can create our own world. Look at it jiggle. It really wants us to notice this. Create a world unlocked. So we can go here now, and the thing with this is that we can create our own biome and world size. So we can make a small world with tons of biomes. We can make a big world with tons of biomes. We can make a medium. Let's make a medium one. And we could also, I think, choose, no, we can't choose more than one there, but we can choose more than one here. So we could try to make it so that it has all of the biomes. If we're looking for something specifically in the weird woods, we could do that if we're looking for things specifically in the crystal crags. And this makes it easier than ever to find specific things. So if we wanna do, of course, like the Watchful Wilderness or something similar, now we have that ability. Now the thing is, is that you don't have every biome off the bat. Uh, you have to find them. So I think that there is more biomes in the game to find. And if we find those biomes, then we can, of course, make a world with that biome. But until then, we don't have that ability. So it's interesting. I'm gonna go ahead and probably make one in like, hmm. I would say the weird woods, because I think that that area has a lot of cool things I still wanna find. And you can, there's like weird woods custom as well. Oh, look at this. So say that there is like some stuff I wanna find in this world. So like I really wanna find a swamp creature in it. Weird. So what happens if I do a Weird Woods custom with a gingerbread man in it? That seems weird. Is there just gonna be gingerbread men running around my Weird Woods where they normally do not spawn? I guess we'll go ahead and find out. All right, so here we are in Weird Woods and there are a bunch of gingerbread men running around. They're sort of running around like zombies. This is creepy. Imagine you're traveling to a new land and as you embark, it's misty, it's dark, and then Tens upon tens, even hundreds of gingerbread men are wandering around. That would be actually, look at how many are on the map right now. This is really weird. And they're all clamoring for berries. Where am I gonna get all these berries? Oh no. I hope nobody has a gingerbread man uh, fear in, that's watching. If you do, uh, my utmost apologies. But it's very cool, the crazy stuff you can do. 
So of course, if there's anything else we wanna continue finding in the series, we can use this method if we already had the biome unlocked. And that's what I wanna talk about right now. There really is an insane amount of mushroom men here. But that's what I wanna talk about right now is the continuation of the series. There are still things I wanna do in this game. Of course, there's still plenty to find, but that's sort of the end of the main adventure, I would say. The big goal of this series was to become a master builder. That's why, of course, the first episode is becoming a master builder. That's why I settled that, because it's the beginning of my journey to becoming a master builder. So I just sort of wanna ask you guys, if the you know the series continues, what would you like to see? Or would you like us to you know, continue on the new adventures? Would you like me just to continue with the building episodes? All that kind of stuff I would like to know, but I think that's just about what we're gonna be finishing things off for today. I hope you enjoyed today's episode of LEGO Worlds. If you did, make sure to give this video a like, share with your friends and family, and of course, comment in the comment section below. If you watch this point of video, make sure you comment Master Zebra, so I know you've watched this video and that you're a zebra-tastic viewer. By the way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.